Hello, this is Chris Walker with the Angie Fan Channel here in Hawaii. Back with another in my A to Z series of reactions and reviews of songs based on Musty Shackelford's compilation of 132 songs, which at the time was just about every song that she had done. Now there's quite a, fit, quite a few more for the collection. This is one that is going to be mainly a reaction rather than a review. But I only heard it once, I think, because one of the, it was an Instagram clip uh, you know, just part of the song, just one minute long, so again, in my early days of exploring Angelina Jordan, I kind of passed over these. So, uh, looks like she has a good microphone though, and it is on her official cover channel, even though it's just a short clip, so that might be an indication that the sound quality is better than I remembered. She has that good mic, it looks like. I know very little about this Queen song, so, uh, I'm just kind of I'm not comparing it to the original here. Um, so let's see what I think. Tonight I'm gonna have myself a real good time. I feel Very, very nice, nice tone. Uh, when she does these, there's another Queen song that um, she did recently on TikTok, which is one of her best TikToks, I thought. And it had this kind of, it's on almost operatic style, you know, because Freddie Mercury had kind of an almost operatic style. And I'd really like to see more of this voice. But uh, yeah, so far, this is. Um, well, I hope that car wasn't too loud. But anyway, so far this is uh, quite impressive and uh, looks like she needs to do a full length version. And as I listen to it, I can kind of vaguely remember the original Queen. I'm going to go back, back a little. This is so short. All right. Great phrasing. Don't stop me because I'm having a good time. Having a oh, good time. Change of pace. I listen to the sky like a tiger that follows the laws of gravity. I'm racing far past and by. Let it go, diver. I'm gonna go, go, go. There's no stopping me. Well, that was. I was certainly surprised by that. Um, speeding up there and um that's there's a lot of things that are unusual about this that you know that i would like to see more from her one thing is that with that speeding speeded up part she rarely does anything that's that fast and she showed that she could certainly pull it off so yes this is one that she definitely needs to do the whole way through it's too short for me to have it among her very best ones but the singing quality is excellent uh that little part where she was doing the short little syllables there was was wonderful and then the flawlessly handled this change in speed now i do want to go back and, and see the whole queen song and see what she could do with the entire version but uh, yeah um so you know if she wanted to she could do a rock album with all these fast-paced songs and it would be great so uh, and, uh, you know, Adam Lambert is now the, I guess he still is the new lead singer for, for Queen. And uh, he's a good choice because of his uh, vocal style. But if they wanted to do a female, I think she would be an excellent choice. You know, they could do Bohemian Rhapsody, they could do it her stripped down way, and then they maybe, for an encore, they could do the, the regular Queen way. And I think both versions she would handle well. So, uh, yeah. Do some more rock and roll, Angie. So, yeah, that was great. I'm glad I got to revisit that. So this is Chris Walker with Big Angie Fan Channel saying aloha. <laughs>